Hey guys, it's Lena and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a what's on my iPhone video. I was trying to decide what to do and I asked you guys on Instagram what you wanted to see from me and somebody requested this and I was like, I should do this. I've never done one before and it sounds really fun. So I wanted to do it for you guys today. So let's just get started. I have the iPhone 8. This is my case. It's just like holographic and then I have a basic black pop socket because I love ha having a pop socket on there. And then my phone is just gold. This is my background. I honestly just put this on there for New Year's Eve and I haven't changed it yet. It's just like sparkles. Right when you get on, we just have Pinterest. If you want like sneak peeks for videos and stuff. For some video ideas, I pin them to my page. One of my boards is for YouTube. And so I have my different baking videos I've done in the past if you guys want to follow me on there then you can see like some video ideas coming up next on here I just have Netflix which is just an essential I have sandbox which is just like a coloring app since I got a new phone I haven't used this app yet I don't know why the app isn't working right now but basically you just color by number and it's really fun then I just have sub count and it shows you how many subscribers you have for whatever channel you type in YouTube studio which is just like your analytics for your YouTube YouTube channel, calendar, word cookies, which is super fun. Once again, I haven't used this app on my new phone either because I just got this phone and I haven't had time to do it. What you do is just swipe to make words with the letters on the pan. And then I just have home, which I have no idea what that is. Tips, notes. On notes, I just write out different things like random stuff. We have FaceTime, phone, Spotify, which I don't think I've used on this phone yet either, but usually I just follow other people's playlists. I don't make playlists myself personally. Find iPhone, which uh, just comes with the phone. Dexcom, which you guys probably know what that is. It's just my blood sugar. And then Dexcom Clarity is where you can like see your time and range, reports, and share it with your doctor, which is what I do. Then I have Papa's Pizzeria because whenever I was re-downloading apps, I saw it and I was like, I always think I want to play it, but then I never do. I haven't played it yet. If you guys haven't played this, what are you doing? But I'm pretty sure everybody has played this. You just pick your character and then basically build, make, build pizzas. Yeah, you build the pizzas. Bitmoji. This is mine. Here she is. That's what she looks like. Then we have Rolling Sky, which... I'm so mad, I'm just now realizing I lost all my progress from my old phone. It took me forever to pass these levels. I worked so hard at it, and now I don't have it anymore. But basically, I'll do level one so I can do good for you guys. You just slide the ball and don't die. And then at the top right corner, it has a percent of how far you are on the level. And it's making me log into Game Center now, so I don't know. Then I just have Dote, which is like, I just downloaded this, so I haven't had it for that long. It's making me start over once again because I'm not logged in. But you just choose stores you like, and I just picked kind of random ones. You can shop all your favorite stores on here, and then you can follow other people and see what clothes they are into, and then it'll tell you the different sales for the different stores you like, so it's really awesome. Then I just have Metro Timer. It's just a metronome, so it helps me keep the beat when I practice piano. Mail, weather, app store, and then down here is my main apps. I obviously have YouTube because it's my favorite stuff ever. Snapchat, messages, and Safari. If you guys want to add me on Snapchat, here you are. <laughs> but I just post on there whenever I upload anything. If you guys want to add me on here, then you definitely should. This is my username. It's just type one with Elena because I made this account whenever that was still my YouTube username. And if you guys couldn't tell, I do have my apps in rainbow order because I was watching a what's on my iPhone video like a year ago maybe and somebody had theirs like this and I just loved it so I had to do it too. On my next page I just have files, keynote which I don't use either of those. Pandora I use all the time when I do my homework, when I'm working out. It's just my go-to music app and I love playing super fruit radio and then I listen to a lot of Glee cast holiday radio. Piano Guys Holiday Radio for Christmas stuff. Shazam, which if you guys don't know what this is, 
It's if you don't know what a song is, which most newer cars tell you what the song is, but I still downloaded it in case I never really use it, but what you do is you tap this button and it listens and tells you what the song is in case you want to download it. We just have Twitter. Make sure to follow me on there as well. This is my profile. I need to change my wallpaper. I don't know what that is. It needs changed. My username is once again type one with Lena. I just post on here when I upload so you guys can be notified and go check it out before anyone else sees the video so be sure to follow me on there then we just have my fitness pal and I just recently downloaded this I sometimes use it especially when I have school I don't really have time to use it but it just tracks your calories and carbs and everything else and then it'll tell you how many carbs are in certain things so it's really cool to have skyward which is just like my grades for school quizlet I use this all the time to study for tests I haven't logged in yet but I have tons of study sets that I use. I've used this for two years now. I absolutely love this. I use this for pretty much every single test I need to study for. This AT&T mobile thing was just to transfer the data from my old phone to this phone. I didn't want to like accidentally delete it and then lose everything so I'm just gonna keep it on my phone. The weather channel which is the weather. This is the one I use. It's literally 17 degrees here right now. Then we have clips. It just came with the new phone and I haven't tried it out yet. Podcasts don't use that. Yahoo Mail, which is just in case. Okay, I have this mark on my hand from school. I'm just now remembering that's on there. But I just have Yahoo Mail if you guys want to email me. But it's just for in case any of you guys want to contact me. If you guys had questions or anything. Then iMovies just comes with this. I used to edit. You go back to my very first videos. I literally filmed them on my phone. Edited them on my phone with iMovie. So I love iMovie. But I got Final Cut Pro. So I love Final Cut Pro too. Then we just have Instagram. Obviously go follow me. This is my page. This is called Lena Elise because you can change your username on here. But once again, I just post on here when I upload. And honestly, I do a lot of where I do video requests. You guys can direct message me on here and leave, tell me anything you want to see from me. And I'll do it for you guys. Instagram is where you can contact me and I'll answer you right away. <laughs> then we have the iTunes store, news, health countdown which I don't think I have any on here yet since I got a new phone but on my old phone I had countdown to Christmas my birthday my anniversary things like that then we have Papa's Cupcakeria because once again just like the pizza one I saw it and I thought I needed that for some reason then we just have photos there's Kayla okay all my selfies are full of Kayla that's that's great Kayla thanks then we have the Canon connect app which is just how I connect to my camera on the Wi-Fi to take thumbnail pictures sometimes or to sync the camera to here then we have capture which is just how I'm recording my screen right now maps which I don't use because I don't drive music activity which is just for my Apple watch you can like track your activity on there reminders I don't really use that voice memos don't use that calculator contacts camera pretty sure you guys know what the camera is then we just have a clock where I set my alarms and these are just to get up for school and then we have settings compass wallets I don't really use those EOS remote this one is another one to connect to my camera stocks Apple watch which is where you can like change the face of your watch and stuff like that and then we have beyond type 1 which you guys if you don't know about this and you will have type 1 diabetes you definitely need to get this app it is literally like an Instagram for type 1 diabetics you can talk to different people on here you can ask questions if you need help with anything you can send messages privately to people if you just want to if you have a friend on here it's so so cool definitely go check it out this is my profile it's just Lena Elise and I post on here when I upload as well so you guys definitely won't be missing out on anything I upload if you follow me on anything and then when you slide over you can just see my blood sugar right there so that is all that's on my phone hopefully you guys enjoyed this video it's not the most interesting apps and stuff but it's just basic stuff and I think my rainbow apps are cool. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Be sure to check out my vlog channel. I vlog on there quite a bit. It's always at the top of the description. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.